Toronto has backtracked on this, and it was a uh, it was a sign put up at a ball ground, a ballpark ground in town recently. They've removed it. It was at McGregor Playground, and for those of you who didn't see it, it's disgusting. It it gave me a visceral reaction. Use of hard balls not permitted. Aluminum bats not permitted. Competitive high level play not allowed. Home runs not allowed, <laughs> and somewhere there, no drinking allowed. How dare you? How dare you with the drinking? Now, the signage was put in place following safety concerns from residents of a nearby condo. Apparently, balls were breaking windows. Nobody likes that, but you're next to a ballpark. These things are going to happen. It's like complaining when you live in a golf course. you got to deal with some things. The city said new signage is being installed. Home runs will no longer be banned, but balls must remain with the park enclosure, within the park enclosure. This is one of the dumbest things <laughs> I've seen in quite some time. And we're talking about the city of Toronto when it comes to signage. <laughs> Mayor, go ahead. <laughs> oh, man. I mean, I echo what you're saying, Sid. I can't believe this has been... I mean, when you look at that sign, I mean, it was thought about, approved, planned, created, look, hung. City of Toronto. You know, it's on some kind of everlasting material. Like, this was a permanency that just, I mean, it feels like an SNL episode. The only thing it's missing is no running. Rules applied <laughs> to this diamond. No, no home runs. No home runs. What are we doing? No, no at a running. diamond. That's the goal of a baseball game. Is it not to hit a home run? No looking. We are lowering the bar. Wow. That's what we're doing substantially. This goes along with the no tobogganing sure does. at the other parts. Like, it's the same thing. It is no fun. That condo that was built in the area where all of those complaints came from, this is according to Michelle Mackey. She put together the story last night for City News. That was built in 2018. But that park has been there forever. Mm. So <laughs> the park went. Yeah. If the park was there first, it went. Now they have these, this netting and the protective trees as well that have been put up to try to stop these home run balls. Or trees. Yeah. They're just but, getting wall up. But the fact that it even got it. to that point, even no, uh, no, it's only underhand pitching. Did you see that one? Oh, yeah, that one's wow, too. Only yeah. underhand pitching. By the way, but you can also you hit a home run better. with underhand pitching. In fact, you can. it's easier Yeah. with underhand pitching to go deep to right field. But what's like, the no competitive play? What is I that no rule? Idea. No competitive play? Sorry, that's not a Jays knock either. <laughs> that's just no for the kids playing in the right. park. No competitive play. It nice. disturbs me. It disturbs me this, that planning went into this. It disturbs me that sign was printed. It disturbs me a meeting was had over Zoom or Teams, I'm guessing, <laughs> to, to sign off on it. And, I, the, and that was officially done. If, it were, if that were a bike lane discussion, make 30. If that were anything involving bikes in the city, no problem at all. But when it comes to tobogganing, when it comes to playing in a park, when it comes to hitting a home run, when it comes to exercise outside, when it, when it comes to getting our kids off, off a tablet, for God's sakes, mm -hmm. which is harder to do by the minute, no, 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 no. We can't do that. We, you can't play anymore. That's ridiculous. Absolutely ridiculous. And I know I'm preaching to the choir here. We all feel the same way. Like, I'm fine with pulling the sign down. Let's lose the idiocy where the sign goes up. Can we start doing that? Mm -hmm. Can we start having some common sense in the meeting where someone says, you know what, I know it's not a bike lane, but maybe it's kind of important for people too. And I understand, I don't want my window busted, but if you live near a park, some things are going to happen, and it's unfortunate, and talk to the city about maybe compensating you for it. Maybe go down that road instead of banning everything. And if the solution was to put up that netting and the trees and whatever else, why didn't we get to that solution before we got to Thank the you. sign? Yeah. <laughs> no. Thank you. Do that first. Hit those home runs, kids. Swing for the fences. Or the fences. We should run the city. <laughs> I'm sorry. We should run the city. No, I, all of us. I'm too tired. I want, this I'm too tired. I want no part yeah, of that. Me too. <laughs> I want I no part of that. I can convince you. <laughs> Sunny Sid. Sunny Sid. Positivity. Look